What's going on, everybody? Eddie Soundhead back once again here with Soundhead Entertainment, and we are back in Wreckfest once again here today. After a couple weeks off to check out the new NASCAR Heat 5 and dive into that, we are back in Wreckfest. And what better way to get back into Wreckfest than with a return trip to Talladega, but not just any Talladega. This is a brand new updated Talladega. That's right, the track that we know and love has received a facelift in the very track pack, and it is beautiful. Of course, we've got the 90s NASCAR mod back here again with the deuce at Dega. I got no excuse to lose. So let's go ahead and dive ourselves into the brand new Talladega. Well, we are off and underway here at the brand new Talladega. Will the turn one meme live on? Of course it does. This is Wreckfest we're talking about. We got somebody up on the safer barrier and I've been already had. I've been jumped. Oh, and the big one opens up right in front of me and there's just nowhere to go. Well, I mean, there kind of was, but did I find the hole in time? Certainly not. And this one seems to be pretty much wrapped up right from the get go. Oh, Brandon Brown getting turned right in front of me. And we're all going to the fence. It's a big one. I'm catching a right on top of Clickerman. Oh, and the pileup is piling up even more. This is a massive one to Benedetto flipping up at the top. Parsons flipping down here off my roof. What in the world is turn one? Third time's the charm for us to survive it, but it's kicking off already. Keep it low. Oh, there's one up on the safe repair here again. Bouncing around everybody to Benedetto and I bouncing off of each other and up to the wall we're gonna go and that's just not gonna go well at all. Just absolutely getting tossed around like garbage back here and I'm gonna get spat back out in the right direction. How about that for luck? I'll take it, I'm gonna lose as much spots though. Oh, who's that up there going to the wall? I'm going to the wall. Try not to emulate it, it's Briscoe. It looked like he might have packed somebody pretty good there through the corner and look at the run. We're getting all the spots we're making up. Oh, I don't like that little bobble they do. I just do not like it. It makes me uncomfortable. Leave me a lane, Jimmy. Oh, there was no lane. There was only quarter panels. And he's gonna squeeze me out to the finish here. Oh, unless he gets wrecked himself, Junior Johnson coming in. Oh, look at the front. Look at him up there for the win. And they're all gonna wreck at the line, it looks like. John Hunter Nemechek gets the win. What in the world happened up there? We have no choice but to watch the replay of this one. I gotta figure out what the heck happened up there. John Hunter Nemechek, P2 off the corner. There you see us wrecking with Jimmy Spencer. But coming to the line here, he's gonna come to the triangle and P2 and a slow car of Chase Briscoe is gonna take out the leader, Harry Gant, and allow John Hunter Nemechek to sneak through to the checkers. Gotta watch out for those guys hitting the brakes on the bottom, just like that, huh, Briscoe? Oh, I'm gonna dump Johnny Sauter and take myself with him. And now I'm doing somersaults on the fence like a bum. And I'm lining myself up for a bad time. And it was bad indeed. What a scathing ass pack into a barrel check. And look at that guy having a tumble of a lifetime down there. Oh, we've caused pain all around here. At least he's gonna land it. Oh, one up to the wall. Matty D just gonna park it in the back of Brandon Brown again. We got one ride in the safer barrier again. Man, it's good to know the turn one meme hasn't gone anywhere. Oh, excuse me, pardon me, down on the bottom of Newman, up to the top side of LeBay. You love to see it. That was a nice little move. We got a run on the high side, and we just get stuffed by Dale Jarrett instead. And we stuff it in the wall. Oh, and then he gets plowed into. What the hell was that, man? Can't have anything out here, and here they go again. Getting kind of ridiculous. We can't even make it to the first corner, you maniacs. Look at this mess around me. Oh, this is a real mess. I could have dumped Jarrett right there, and I'm going to get dumped myself. The Terminators just don't care. They've thrown all regard clean out the window. Yeah, give him a push, Dale. There you go. Don't turn me, you bums. What are you doing, you scumbags? You actual wastes. Oh, I hate all of you. Look what they've done to me. I'm true X and Kane or whoever you attribute this to. I just got banged in the head. There's a lonely tire just bouncing down the road. How sad is that? Almost as sad as me laying here in a heap on the track. Oh, Matty D is going to leave me out the dry and go down low. Got to watch out for Bell, and then Brandon Brown just dumps me. Turns up like I wasn't even there. Without a shred of shame, that man. Oh, oh my God, Dick Brooks just coming to a stop in the racing lane, you maniac. Oh, and what's going on up here? Somebody just got nailed. Ryan Blaine just got a mouthful. It looked like somebody clocked him while he was upside down. And that checked a bunch of guys up like Briscoe here who's going to get ass packed in the trioval. And we come screaming by to take 12. Got Ryan Newman in the army car. That has not worked out well at Talladega before. And it's not working out well in turn one here as we just go and pack him right up. 
It is especially fitting that Newman is in that army car, considering he went flying in an army car that one time, like 10 years ago. Oh, why? What did you gain? What did you gain, Parker? Absolutely nothing. Other than giving me a clicky wheel for the last couple seconds of this race. You abomination. But we got 10th. Oh, Christopher Bell slowing up right in the lane, gets himself packed. Briscoe goes up to the wall and rides it a little bit, and he's going to come back down and kind of cut us off. We take it to the apron. We got another one riding the wall up here. I'm going to get pushed from behind, and that's going to be Briscoe right into, I think it was Junior Johnson up there, still riding that wall back there. I'm boxed in, and I'm not a big fan of it, and that's why. Johnny Sauter just stopping in the lane. What are you doing? Didn't mean to pack you, but you leave me no choice when you do that, and then I just get dumped by good old John Hunter Nemechek anyway. So what's that matter? What does it matter? You know what does matter? A little bit of one of my favorite things that I very rarely do, but it may be time. It's time for us to hit a backwards run real quick. Where you at, John Hunter? Can I find him? No, I can't. Oh, I definitely didn't get Nemechek, but I got somebody. And I got the fence, I got crooked wheels, I got missing wheels, I, I got all kinds of problems here. Oh, Brandon Brown's gonna be the one to hit the brakes in the middle of the corner, and then De Benedetto bounces off of Bell, and that's gonna stuff me in the wall once again there in a the near miss. That's my run, pretty much shot right there. Neat, great, grand, wonderful, and spectacular. Go ahead and run the cycle as you please, because that is anti-neat. And we have got the big one breaking out right here in front of us. Man, do we ever? Oh, man, the Benedetto across the nose. Oh, my God. Oh, Briscoe, are you going to be the one holding everybody up? Am I going to have to pack you? Oh, I do. I did. Oh, it's going to end up whirling for me. This is not ending well for me at all. And the wheels come off. No, not the wheel. Oh, my God. We just launched that guy into the fence, and he is riding it around. What a legend. Oh, Matty D goes high, I go low, we split Brandon Brown in the middle. Now can we navigate this pack up here? He's just gonna pack the back of them as they all go up to the wall. A bunch of them look like they just turned over and we are gonna sneak through on the inside by a two-wheel and Johnny Sauter. And we get out in front of a bunch of them right there. Huge spots gained right there. Oh, Blaney, can I sneak it under? Oh, I'm gonna bounce off the wall. Not really what you wanna do, not the ideal trajectory but it has got us onto the podium. And I can get by Jimmy Spencer here with this massive run. Please don't wreck me down the straightaway. Some of you AI have been known to do it. Thank you very much. Now, will Harry Gant let off and let himself come back to us or will we just get dumped by Jimmy Spencer instead? You slime ball. I'm gonna get back to you, Jimmy. I could pay you back, but I got bigger fish to fry right now. I want that dump. Come on, Harry. Oh, we're gonna go side by side into a corner. This is not a comfortable feeling, and we bounce off each other. Oh, another near hit there. We're gonna swap lanes, and he breaks, and he takes me out! Are you kidding me? Are you serious? Really? 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 Well, I've seen it all now. At least he didn't win. But talk about a Terminator. From potentially first to 15th. Oh, I'm gonna have to go underneath Brandon Brown again. Bounce off of Matty D. Get off of that apron. This is Ryan Newman's getting stuff on the wall. And he's gonna come back down to me. Would everybody just relax? Everybody just take a deep breath. You're all losing it in the first freaking corner. Oh, look at this run I have on Dale Jarrett. Now, Dale, don't you... Oh, Dale! How low can you be? I knew it. He's done it before. He'll do it again! There it is. I knew it. How, how is a respectable man like Dale Jarrett going to do this to me and then I just get packed and that's going to put me in the inside wall? That's just a horrific sight. Dale, I'm about at enough of you, Dale. Come here, you bump! waste get back here oh briscoe and bell getting into it over here gotta watch out for briscoe and now i'm wearing him as a hat would you get off of me oh we just get tangled and tossed up in the air and creamed 
can't even flip in peace. I gotta get hit in the middle of that too. Grand. Well, the new Talladega is certainly proving to be quite the foe as we're back in the replay mode to watch what in the hell happened here because I don't think anybody has a clue. But we just get launched, me and Briscoe, and then the 82, I believe that's Benny Parsons, just cleans me out once and for all. I'd really like to clear Johnny Sauter before this corner. Please let me get underneath LePay. Somehow we did it with a slight tap to Johnson, and he's going to turn me. Junior Johnson, also without even a morsel of regret, has just caused the huge one, and I'm getting lifted up and carried and packed and stuffed. Just stick a fork in me. Well, here we are in the replay again, and you will see that was not even close to being an accident. 110% Terminators detected on causing this accident, and it was a big one. Cars flipping and flying in every direction. That 09 is getting tossed, and Brandon Brown up on the safer barrier like a train on the tracks. Please don't box me in, Bell. Please don't do these things to me. Can barely handle it when you guys aren't screwing me over at every possible chance. Look at this guy, by the way, JHN. Oh, don't leave that hole open in the middle. I thought about it. This is not going to end well, though. And up in the wall we go. I shouldn't have even dreamed of three wide because this was obviously going to be the outcome. We get packed. We got cars going up to the fence and we take a shot. Right to the mouth and on the lid we land. Oh, Nemech. Wow, what a block. What a block. That useless little swerve that you do. Oh, I hate it. I hate it. And then I had to get packed right after. And you want more. And you want more. That was not enough. Unbelievable. I'm being carried down the track. And this is this has just become appalling. We have had a horrible one here in the trioval, and it's only getting worse by the second. That guy is just God all oh my look at this guy. Look at this poor sap. He finally comes to a rest. Oh! What did we do? What did we do to deserve this? Why? That was such an action-packed crash. That lasted like all the way from turn four to the end of the trioval. We have to look at a replay of it. We have no choice. John or Nemechek just tried as hard as he could to take us out. Missed the first time and then got us again in the exit of turn four and finally did finish the job. And then everybody just came through that 64, just launched up in the air, tossed around, twist around. And speaking of getting twisted around, here we are. 37 comes through and just packs us and launches himself into the unholiest series of flips that I've seen in a long time. Then Ryan Blaney comes through and gives us one last pack. We bounce off the caution lights and ricochet back into the infield. Don't make me time this pass on you. Jimmy, oh, what did you do, Jimmy? You did like a Jimmy and Brian Vickers. You pulled out at the wrong time on me. And look at me now. I'm being killed. I just got obliterated in the most pure definition I can think of. And the hits are not over yet. We just got the soul blasted out of us. Not once, but twice. Oh my, oh God, no, oh, Jesus, a third time. Have mercy on me, please. And once again, we find ourselves here in the replay viewer getting Casey Kane or Truex. And then here comes the pack full of vengeance and they just give us lift off there. We get space forced and didn't even really realize it. But then we're going to go ahead and slide it back up into traffic right where that 64 is lined up. And then he gets packed himself afterwards. We go tumbling down the racetrack once again. And where do we lie but in that racing lane? And if we give it long enough, I think a kind fellow in the 53 car will come through and deal us the killing blow to our spirits. Oh my, that guy has stopped. What is he doing? Oh my God. Parker Kligerman just nuked the leaders. He just LePaged us worse than actual LePage, and here comes an ass pack on the safer barrier. What did I just see? Gonna make me go low again, guy. All oh, bells breaking hard, and Newman, we catch on Newman. And that's gonna be all she wrote right back up in the fence again, and Bell's coming back for a little packery on the wall again. Like a daily commute up here. 
You guys make me go high. You better stay low. That's not staying low. That's not staying low at all. I just had to drive underneath someone. And Alex LeBay up on the wall. Oh, man. Brennan gone up on the wall. But we had to drive underneath the pirouetting 51. That was sick. And Matty D with the pack. Well, we've got two laps to climb our way up the podium here, and it starts with Harry Gann as he lets off big time into turn one. We give him a wide berth and put it in the wall even, and I'm gonna do the same thing with Ryan Blaney, but on the other side here, not playing any games or taking any chances, and that's why right there, I saw that swerve. If we had been any closer to Blaney right there, he would have took us out 110% for sure. And now it's just down to me and Mr. Excitement, Jimmy Spencer, he lets off big time into three. And that may be all we need. And we put it in the wall again. Oh, we're going to give ourselves a clicky wheel, but we get ourselves to the lead. And that is going to do it through the trioval for one final time. Got some wreck avoidance at the start of this one, but then it stayed clean and green to the end. And we can collect our dope. Well, there you have it. We will let the dust settle on another day here at Talladega as we finally conquered the brand new update. And what an update it is, man. It gets two thumbs up for me. I know we've only run the 90s cars here so far, but so far, so good. And you know we have plenty of things to come back with. We've got the Legends, we've got the 70s cars, we've got Pinball and Moon Gravity. I know a lot of people have been asking for those to come back. We've got NASCAR Heat 5, which just dropped. We can have some more fun with that. And we've got F1 2020, something we haven't really gotten into that much here on the channel, some Formula One. Got into it the last couple of years, and hey, maybe it's time to dip our toes into that series of games as well. So let me know what you guys think down in the comments. Hit that like and subscribe button if you haven't already. It helps me out a ton, and with that, I will see you all in the next one. Peace!